We have a full stage this morning. I'm happy to see you. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Raise your hand if you've ever had a day where you just felt kind of down. Anybody ever had a day like that? Maybe just things weren't going right and just felt kind of down. What do you do on those days? Is there anything that helps you on those days? What helps you on those days, Madeline? When my mom gives me a hug. When your mom gives you a hug. That can help. What helps you on those days, Taylor? When your mama gives you something that you really want. What helps you on those days, Perry? Kisses. <laughs> Kisses can make a difference. How about you, Teddy? Something that you like that can make you feel better on those days. How about you, Olivia? Watching a Disney movie. That makes everybody feel better, doesn't it? Yep. Well, this morning, I want to show you something that might help you remember how you should respond when you are having a day that you feel down. Okay? And so I just have here a pitcher of water. And I have a piece of cork. And cork is something you might use on a bulletin board or something like that. And so I'm just going to place this cork in this water, and I'm going to push it down, just like you might feel on a day when you're feeling down or feeling discouraged, okay? And we're going to see what the cork does. So I'm going to put the cork in the water, and I'm going to push it down. It's a bad day. Nothing's going right. Everything's going wrong. I can't get anything to work. And so I'm just going to get down here and get discouraged and hold this cork down and, oh, what happened? It floats. Wait, let me just try it again. Must be something wrong. This is a down day, and I'm just mad and discouraged, and I'm just going to hold it down, and nothing's going right. And so, what happens? It rises right back to the top. I want you to think about that same thing. When you are having a day where you feel down or you feel discouraged, not to let that hold you down because you can be just like this cork. You know, this cork is actually made up of molecules that are so close together that they will not allow the water to enter. And that's why it floats. And we should be doing the same thing as Christians and believers in God. We should be so close to one another and so close to God that when that discouragement tries to enter in, it can't even get in because we're too close together. Because you see, people don't sink because they get in the water. People sink when the water gets in them. The same thing is true about discouragement. You can have discouragement going on all around you. That doesn't mean it has to be going on inside you. It doesn't mean it has to be going on in your mind. So whenever you have moments and those days that are just not going right and everything seems down, I want you to remember this cork and how it continues to rise no matter how many times it is pushed down because it does not let the discouragement get in it. It stays above that. It rises above that. And we can do that by praying to God, by encouraging one another. I want you to not just be someone who receives encouragement but also who gives encouragement who lifts others up and helps raise others up. Will you all say a blessing together with me today? Let's say a blessing. May we always find encouragement in God. Amen.